Hi, my name is Matthew Pierce. I'm a software engineer, and today I'd like to talk with you about how to stop a WGET download. Now, WGET is an open source tool for downloading uh, content from FTP and web servers, uh, and it does it in the background. It's just used to retrieve it while you're doing other things, and you start it up, you let it go, and it's, it's very, uh, a very nice tool in that it takes care of flaky connections or slow servers or whatnot. It'll just keep retrying over and over until it gets the content downloaded. Now, the problem is with that is that it can run in the background and you, you can't see it running. You don't know what it's doing and you may want to kill it and not have it uh, continue on. So to do that, there are several ways to kill it. And I'm going to show you how to do it on uh, Linux or Mac, basically the Unixy ones. This also runs on, um, it runs on Windows, and it can run on Mac OS and OpenVMS. It runs on all, it's available for all search of operating systems, but you kind of handle it all the same way. So I've got here, I've got a window open where I've got uh, wget set up to download the suci.org uh, web page. And the first thing I'm going to show you how to do is just do a simple control C. So you get it going, oops. You get it going, say you want to kill it, control C, and it's done. That easy. The second way I'm going to show you how to do it is to use the kill, kill all command. So then what you do, get it going again, then you can just right here go kill all, and that'll terminate it too. So it's pretty easy. Another way to do it is you can just control this, or close the shell window that it's in. You can type wget, get it going, it's going, and then kill that, say close the terminal, sure. Then you can go ps minus ef grep for wget, and you can see it's not there. Um, so uh, th those are three ways that you can kill it. Um, on Windows, it's the same thing. You can kill it by um, closing the shell window, control seeing. Um, you can go to the task manager, find it and kill it that way. Uh, so it's, it's pretty easy to do it. You just have to search for it in case you started in the background and then forgot about it. My name is Matthew Pierce. Today we talked about how to stop a WGET download. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.